August, watch Gordas. I'll miss you! Just hurry up. I don't like being alone with this... thing. <gasps> but I like you so much! Hey, have you got a plan for what to say to Scooter? Because he screwed him out of a lot of money for those caravan repairs. He could be angry. And I've heard stuff about what he did to the Zafford clan. He's a pretty jolly guy for someone who just buried another man alive. Now, Scooter's a solid guy. He's not gonna hold a tiny little con against us. I guess he does seem to like us. Yeah, maybe. It's my two favorite gals. Come to see your old sponsor, huh? How go the races? I know you sure like going fast, haha. <laughs> Wait, no, not like you're a fast woman or... Oh, shoot. Uh, like racing's just in your veins, is all I'm saying. I'll shut up. Racing is going awesome. We just won the Grand Chalice and the Bad Attitude Crater Invitational, and I am, woo, tired from that. Uh, y'all know I was joking, right? I know you ain't really racers, but it ain't no big deal. Hell, I knew you was in trouble. And being lied to is one of the less horrific things that can happen to you out here. I'm just happy to see you. What can I do you for? Not saying that I want to do you or nothing. No, it's... Uh, well, not that I'm saying I wouldn't, either. Uh, would one of you, like, open your mouths and make with the wording so I can... I can shut mine? I mean, my uncle always said, never open your mouth. I is that it, Scooter? We are going... To space. What? I love space! It's like my fourth favorite thing! Behind tacos, trucks, and heavy eye contact! That all sounds great! Only problem is funding? No, don't worry about it. Valerie will pay for whatever we need to get to Helios, get the Gordas piece, and get out. I understood exactly half those words. Let's do it! Oh, wait, when I said that there was only one problem, I meant that there were two. Because look, I know a lot about cars and I know a lot about engines, but rockets are right out of my purview. My business partner knows rockets like you wouldn't believe, but she's, uh, she's a little out of sorts. Oh, no. Janie's been like that since she heard about some big bald hunter fight what happened out in the tundra. Athena ain't checked in for a while. She put two and two together. She ain't much of a mood to do rocket stuff. Maybe you should talk to her, Fee. You're the last one who saw Athena, right? Yeah. Hi, Janie. Hi, hat girl. She said it was just an easy protection job. As if anything's ever easy out here. I really wanted to believe her. I did. But she forgot to turn her echo off the last time we spoke. Oh. I heard the two of you talking. Her echo went dead after the fighting started. I couldn't... What was she doing? Why did she lie to me? I need to know. I know she was protecting you, but why? She said it wouldn't be dangerous. She said... It's like you heard. It was just a, a simple protection mission. Take us from Hollow Point to a little hovel out in the tundra. Nobody was more surprised than me that we got attacked. I don't know that I believe you. Look, if I thought I was in danger of fighting off Vault Hunters, why would I only hire one to protect me? Don't those guys usually come in, in groups of four? I hired Athena because I wasn't expecting trouble. We just got unlucky. So what happened to her exactly? I've never seen Athena lose a fight. How'd she get grabbed? So long as she's got that shield, I've never seen anyone so much as lay a finger on her. It doesn't make sense. She can't... Damn it. It took two Vault Hunters, and Valerie, and her entire gang just to take her down. Heh. <laughs> That's my girl. Ha ha ha. This is kind of awkward. Change the subject. These nice ladies want us to build a rocket for them? What do you say? I don't know if I've got the parts. Sure you do. Come on! You just gotta- I just want to know one last thing, and then I'll see about the rocket. 
Did she say anything about me before they took her? The way she acted, sometimes I didn't even know if she liked me. Like maybe I was just a fluke or something. Hell, you don't need to hear this. Sorry. She told me to pass on a message. She said she loves you. She did? I... Oh, goodness. Okay. Oh, wow. Young lady, you are going to have yourself a rocket. And once I'm done building it, I'm going to grab every gun I can carry, I'm going to drive out of here, I'm going to rescue my girlfriend, and I'm going to marry the piss out of her. I'm in. I can probably build you something that'll break Atmo, but beyond that, you'll want a mechanic on board to make sure it doesn't explode on you. Oh man, that sounds like a job for the scooter man if I ever heard one. And considering it's a dream of mine to catch a ride into space and all that, it would be like just, just wow. What do you say, ladies? Scooter, want to come with? Be our onboard mechanic? You mean it? Whoa, space buddies! Fiona was talking her way into a rocket caravan, I was going to meet up with Wallethead. Fortunately, I had company. I, uh, should have said this earlier. <laughs> Can't believe Fiona let you get stabbed. Don't blame her. She couldn't have known. Valerie was the one holding the knife. I'm just glad she agreed to help when she did. Hold me. I'm not sure how I feel about you going to Helios without me. I think I'm kinda glad. I don't know if I want to get tempted to stay. But then again, it'd be nice to see some people. Yvette, especially. You belong on Pandora. You love it here. Yeah. Yeah, I, I kinda do. I mean, did you get a little stabbed? Sure. But, look at it. You're handling yourself in ways that I would have never expected. And jumping on Valerie's back like that? That was pretty epic, wasn't it? <laughs> totally. I mean, she beat the living shit out of me right after you left. And I took it! Uh, of course she did. But, but, you saved my ass. I did, didn't I? <laughs> you did. You think I should try and escape while you guys are gone? I mean, if I'm the only collateral she has, maybe it'll help if I'm off the table. Take away her leverage. I mean, obviously running seems dangerous, but sticking around doesn't seem so great either. Look, you make a break for it as soon as you can. It's got nothing to do with collateral. It's, it's about keeping you safe, so be careful. Okay. We'll find you after we get the piece. I know you will. I have faith in you. You'll make it. Well, it's all you from here. Uh, I'm not sure I could keep up anyway. Feeling pretty worn out. What with being stabbed and all. You're stronger than you look, Vaughn. Um, thanks? There's a strength in you, man. It's it's what's got you this far and what'll keep you going. You know, that and the magic exercise bike. Thanks, man. And it's just a regular exercise bike. Alright, here's how it's gonna go. The man with the plan right here is gonna track down the corpse. And you are staying here. And, uh, if you ain't back with the goods, you could use your buddy's corpse to get inside Helios. Okay, I get it. Off you go. Alright, Reese. Let's just find Vasquez's body, get back here, and... 
not crap our pants. So you ah. are gonna have such a hard on for my office, Reeds. It's well, it's huge. Two out of three ain't bad. My office, not your hard on. Whatever. Uh, back here again. Thought I'd close the book on this weird chapter of my life. Yeah, you better run. You see? I told you so. Wallet head. All right, wallet head. Time to show your face back on Helios. His face has no face. Oh, you better hope a psycho didn't use it for a skin pizza. A skin pill. Oh god. What were the pepperonis? A skin pizza. Oh, you clearly haven't I been can't. on Pandora mm -mm. long enough, compadre. Uh -huh. Let's find Vasquez's face. Mm. And get out of here. You're the boss. All right, look, Reese. What happened between you and me, that's in the past, okay? It's almost like it never happened. Let's just drop it, okay? So we can focus on finding the face. Okie dokie, I'll drop it like a moonshot into a basket full of puppies. No problemo. You gotta keep an eye on your friends during this Helios mission, huh? Unlike how you're not keeping an eye on that tripwire. Uh, what? Looks like these psychos had themselves a little skin pizza party. Uh, how am I gonna find Vasquez's face in all this mess? That's what an echo eye is for, genius. Scan the faces from a nice stab-free distance. Unless you want to get up close and physical with some new psycho pals. Vasquez wasn't that ugly. You and me, Pumpkin, let's rock this walk. Whoa, this place is scaring me and I'm a frickin' hologram. Uh, careful now, I don't want to end up psycho dinner. Oof, disturbing. Not Vasquez's face disturbing, but still disturbing. Glad I wasn't invited to this pizza party. Disturb huh? sleep pattern? Oh, Wallace! Not now. Interrupt. <laughs> Alright, good, good, again! This time with feeling! Give him the old smackdown! Atta boy! Need rest. Big day tomorrow. You die, I sleep! Smacky dabby! I should punch with this arm more often. Okay, listen up, because I'm about to compliment you. No one ever became a leader without dirtying their hands. Oh, you're gonna get Hugo McSwoopy Hair's face back. Looks like we found our psycho. You only see this kind of thing on Pandora. Just rip it off like a bandage. Quick and painful. Oh, mmm. Okay, just peeling it off, peeling off the face, not going to barf into his mouth with your mouth. 
That's it, go on. Peel off that face like a serial killer. You're sick. That is just the, the grossest thing I've ever seen. Oh god, oh. I can't stop now. Oh no, 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 no. Are you kidding me right now? Oh, oh pinch it off. Just pinch it oh. off. Right Seriously? Oh, please don't do it. Please, please, please don't do this to me. Oh, gross. <laughs> Smash the baby's face. Crunch its teeth. <laughs> Run! You're the only one running, pal! I can fly! Well, once I snatch that face pizza, gross, I sprinted out of Old Haven. Hundreds, no, thousands of psychos chased me. Oh, really? That many? Couldn't even got them all. You were too busy trying to save the face. Okay, technically it was one psycho, but he had a bomb strapped to his chest that had the stopping power of like a thousand of... which could... So... One. One. Yeah. So I go with chest bump. Boom! What? Who's going? Little bastard bit me, then ran off. You said something about a bomb, Psycho? Oh. Yeah. Oh, wait! Oh, we were supposed to bring back the body. Oh, we are still bringing it back. It's just gonna take a little longer to collect now. Think I got some baggies in the truck. <laughs> 